I can't freaking believe we've forgotten this. We just headed out to the airport and we've had to come back. We've had a few, uh, we forgot something major, um, this uh, very, very important thing. We need to take to the airport, so let's get back there now. So just come out, taking the boys swimming. Go on, Mitch, off you go. Go, go. Go, go. Right, it's later in the day now, and we're just heading off to the airport. And as usual, there's lots and lots of traffic, as you can see here, you know, going to Swanapum. It's about two hours drive from Songkran, where I live at the moment, uh, through to Swanapum Airport. It's a bit of effort to get there, actually. Uh, it took quite a while. You have to kind of, kind of go round the south of Bangkok and round the city, which uh, is a bit annoying. It was quite busy, to be honest. It was Friday night. Let's have a look a little bit around the bottom of the city. A really important thing you need when you're leaving the country with, with your son and you know you're going to be without your wife which is what i'm doing this time obviously besides his passport obviously you need his birth certificate and it has to be in english and in thai language and then also you need like a letter from my wife a kind of sealed letter you know really official letter stamped uh by the embassy here saying that you know i've got permission to take my son out of the country basically so yeah it's quite an unusual thing um, I didn't quite know about it till I had a kid here and then, you know, normally I go abroad with my wife or I'd go, you know, out to the country with my wife, but, you know, this time I'm not. I'm leaving just with my son, so, yeah, we're having to do this. You thought some of you guys might be in the same boat, you know, sometimes you're leaving the country with your son and, you know, without your, your wife, you know, so you, you need these kind of documents and everything has to be in Thai and in English, uh, so, yeah, it can be a bit of a pain just to get the form, you know, in English, translated to English as well. I'm just enjoying a coffee outside at Amazon, just outside of near the mall bank here. you know what i would call the real kind of outskirts of bangkok there's no tourists you know there's no tourists around here at all i very rarely see any tourists from around this area here i'm just meeting a friend that's why i'm down here today okay we're just driving nearly at the airport now and you know we're a bit knackered to be honest with you and say so, Richie slept all the way to be honest with you. Just have a look around now around uh, Swanapum airport it's uh, you know it's very very busy at the moment there's lots and lots of tourists back here so this is great to see after all the, you know, all the travel restrictions of the past. It's great to see, you know, the, the airport's buzzling again, you know, awesome. If you've never been to Swanapum Airport, it's, a, you know, it's a really superb, huge airport with all, you know, regular, you know, shops there and, you know, lots of places you can get, lots of different, you know, things you need at the airport, you know, last minute things. And yeah, just having a look around the airport now, it's a, you know, very, very up to date airport. If you've never been, if you're not sure, and you're coming here, you know, lots of duty free and all the usual things. So we're just heading off to our gate now, uh, which is right in a good mood, actually. We're just getting onto the plane. He's well excited, to be honest with you. And this is our first flight. Uh, so we're flying to Dubai first. Uh, so let's have a look on the plane here a little bit. Uh, which he was enjoying the headset as usual then he passed out for a few hours and here we are on the plane this is an emirates flight and to be honest it was superb uh, i've flown with emirates before and they're absolutely brilliant to be honest with you the food was awesome just everything about the flight the, the hostesses were just great and this is our connecting flight in uh 
Dubai that we've got to get now. So we're going on to somewhere else after. But here we are arriving in Dubai Airport. Let's have a look. I got a bit of footage, but I was completely knackered, to be honest with you, because I was with Richie on my own. So let's have a look around uh, Dubai Airport. It's a superb airport, to be honest with you. Just everything there. It's an absolutely massive. We had about three hours here. We had to kill before a connecting flight on to where we're going next, our next destination. Uh, it's quite cool. They've got like smoking lounges there and just some random shops all around everywhere to be honest with you and just really fancy stores and you know all your you know all your designer goods stores coming up and you'll see gucci and one or two other ones coming up in a minute Okay, we're arriving at a final destination now. We just cracked off the plane. We're absolutely shattered, to be honest with you. Richie's just getting the luggage in now. And as you'll see in a minute, we're just going through customs. And then we're arriving at our destination. Subscribe to my channel, please. Thank you.